Assalamualaikum, my name is Nur Iman Bin Jaksmadi with Matrix No. 29023. Today, I will present to you about the uh, assignment 1 BIFS 2053 Credit Analysis and Financing with the topic of RHB Credit Card Financing I. Let's start it. Now, I will explain to you about the introduction. Islamic finance and banking are significant industries that exist in recent years because of revolution in global financial industry. According to the data that being showed in the Venezuela Malaysia, Islamic financial institution what will happen to reach its establishment of 1,500 institutions over 80 countries. Meanwhile, Malaysia is the third largest Islamic banking market with 41%, while local banking system loan at the end of 2022 with only 31% which show rapid growth and progressing of Islamic financial and banking industry by producing various products such as home financing, car financing, personal financing, and credit financing. Nevertheless, all Islamic finance and banking must comply with the term, condition, and regulations which has been banned by law in Malaysia. Therefore, Malaysia launched first Islamic credit card in the world under by Al Ina in 2022. Basically, Islamic finance and banking must obey all the regulations, including Islamic teaching. In Islam, all of doing is permissible until come the provision phrase that tells the servant to not consume or just avoid it. For instance, interest, riba, uncertainty of horror, and gambling, which is miser. All of them is strictly prohibited from Islam to join or Muslim, regardless of business type and purpose there are also about the authorities that prepare guidelines or be the supervisor of the company in order for company or bank to maintain their product comply with the standard regulation in terms of financing and uh, sharing ah that stated in Islamic Financial Service Act IFSA 2013 such as Bank Negara Malaysia, the Accounting and Auditing Organization for Islamic Financial Institution and Sharia Advisory Council SAC. Credit card financing is only offered by Islamic financing institution. Meanwhile, in conventional banking, it is known as a credit card financing or loan. Generally, credit card financing provides the customer with the financial tool which can be used in finance purchasing any goods, whether durable or non durable, as well as to cater any other financial obligation of the individual. In a simple term, it can be understood as financing to cover an individual expense. From the sharing of view, credit card can be defined as a tool to cover benevolent funds or beneficial financing in current time and paying it in future using Islamic context such as called SARS. Credit card financing is a form of gratuitous financing that gives to the borrower for a fixed time without needing to pay any interest or charge on the financing or services except the period of payment reached as by date. As one of the sharing ah bank that has existed in Malaysia for a long time, RHB Malaysia are offering Islamic banking products that involve with credit cards to the customer which are RHB Premier Visa Infinite Credit Card and RHB Shell Visa Credit Card I. Next, we will move to the features and benefits of RHB Premier Visa Infinite Credit Card. As for the case for this card, customer who owns the card will get 8 times loyalty in spending overseas retail, 3 times loyalty points for local hotels, dapi free, dining, online spending, and local retail spending. The ticket reward points will be awarded if the if involved with the airlines, dining, dapi free shopping, hotel, MCC. RHB also give unlimited entry for selected Plaza Premier Lounge and Aerotel Malaysia including in the overseas as well such as Singapore, Philippines, Hong Kong, etc. We also give additional 12 times access per calendar year if the customer card has active status and spend minimum retail of 1000 and above after past a month or 10000 in a year. RHB Bank cover the bill up to 2 million for travel insurance and provide coverage for possible losses in purchasing online. Not more than USD 200 per annum under e commerce purchase protection, which includes more functioning of delivery items like physical damage in delivery, 
journey, non-delivery, and incomplete delivery of items. Next, people with the age of 21 years until 65 years old, white, while 18 years old with supplementary card is qualified to apply credit card. RHP Premier Visa Infinite Annual Fees will be waived for both principal and supplementary card. Now we are moving on to the features and benefits of RHP Shell Visa Credit Card I. Uh, each cashback are also different right, based on categories and amount of spending. The user that will get cashback of fuels will get 5% if you use 800 to 1,499 ringgit for 99 cents, 8% for spending amount of 1,500 to 2,499 ringgit for 99 cents, and 12% if spending more than 2,500 ringgit. Meanwhile, for the grocery, online spending, top up wallet, literacy, etc., 1% will be applied if the spending is under 1,499 ringgit for 99 cents, while 2% is if above than 2,499 ringgit for 99 cents and more than 2,500 ringgit, user will get 5% cashback for all five types of spending. The payment which eligible for cashback above are followed by shell petrol station only. Grocery machine like the grocery, grocery, again, giant supermarket. Not only that, the owner can enjoy the cashback by spending via e-commerce mode like Zalora, Food Panda, Great Food, McDonald's Delivery, Tijini, Lazada, and Shopee. There are also provisions of payment which cannot be accepted by bank, which are the transaction under prohibited MCC. For instance, payment for beer, wine, liquor, cigarette, etc. There are also other regulations which not binding with cashback after making a payment. For example, other presidential, annual co brand card membership fees, interest, late payment charge, and card service tax. Annual fee for principal card I for this card is not applicable for the first year of payment of using this credit card. However, for the subsequent year, the owner will be charged with 195 ringgit per annum, but it will be waived if the owner swipe the card with the minimum 55 times swipe per year. Meanwhile, there is no charge or fee that being applied for a supplementary card. So, uh, the other party can enjoy. Next, people with the age of 21 years with the minimum income around 24,000 ringgit per year is eligible to apply the credit card. Next is a funding post of credit card. First is the great way to create the credit score. The credit score which is key to secrets our credit system or the tracker of the credit history will show the user behavior in borrowing and paying the finances. The good responsibility related to the good credit which rise the lifetime quality that accomplish the financial goal. Thus the good tracks of payment of all existing Financing as well will be the reason for the customer to get other financing because of the good financials of Citos and Secrets record is automatically able to convince the bank trust to give further or another financing to them like the credit card financing I. Next is a secure bank cash. Credit cards mostly used because of the security features. The security is more advanced when the user comes to the bank to see the advanced cash. The security aim to avoid the stealing information or fraudulent purchases. If each incident happens, the company or individual can hold the transaction by reporting it to the bank. If the card has been stealing by others, then it's real users. Additionally, credit card companies will always monitor to identify suspicious entities that arise and notify the user if something unusual or inconsistency spending behavior happens. Next is a reward point. Credit card companies or financial institutions often offer reward like additional insurance, loyalty, point, airline miles, cashback assessment, or plaza, golf, and lunch for using their regularly. However, it depends on the benefits of each type of card because all of them have different privileges based on bank's requirement, term, and condition.
mostly the reward point will arise if the user using the frequently in daily expense which resulted to rapid additional points and reward. Those points also can be converted as cash or any other gift that can be claimed in the bank. Next is the finding cons of credit card. First, it's a high cost involving. There also has cons in the credit card which is high cost involving. People will find the credit card is very convenient because of easiest to get the necessary item and pay it later with. However, the cost of borrowing is higher because of its service fee, withdrawal, annual fees, tax, and additional fee that apply with the card application or additional document that we sit on. The tax for each card will be counted as well and cannot be reduced, which makes it a huge amount to pay. Not only that, the charge will also be count after the due date payment of the previous outstanding debt and it will be bind until the user fully made the payment. The next cons of credit card is easy to fall into the risk. Every card has different function of credit card and accessible of limit and it's happen when the new credit card has more limit of spending than particular credit card. Most of the people did not realize about the limitation until they saw the outstanding balance in credit card with the penalty charge. The situation becomes bad when the monthly income cannot cover the debts that have been spent because of excessive credit of limit. The event turns to be worse when users have huge responsibility with lack of fund, especially when the emergency happens like they are needed to be rewarded because of an accident. Thus, it is important to spend reasonable amount of spending which we can afford each month to prevent spending out of budget and help our spending in fruitful track. The third one is the multiple credit card seems to find to be used but also can trigger to the unnecessary spending and damage credit score which increase the credit payment and chance to be default. It starts to be cut off when the user have difficulty to make the payment. The information will be accessible to all lenders and will be affected when the consumers want to apply to the new credit card financing account. The bank gets to track the user's paying behavior if the user missed the paying monthly installment. Besides the bad records and various types of credit card will also write the suspicious offender and bank card as well. The suggestion for the new user to give and get the credit card from bank is looking into the commitment and financial income. Whether the card can be used in the daily necessity Entertainment or both. The usefulness of the card will only applicable if the card meets the requirement with daily necessity rather than entertainment because frequently accepting the Islamic credit card is the good one. The card which gives the points to those activities tend to focus on entertainment side for users who use credit card in certain activity and paying it later in future. Hence, people with, will get the benefit of the card and necessity once they make purchase and payment. It is also easy for them to reach their financial goal when understand their needs and limitations of income very well. People like to apply for credit card financing, but not all of them certainly need. The minimum requirement for it is the majority of age, which is 21 even so. The people who do not reach the minimum age but his status of financing is independently stable, the user may get the chance to use credit card if he reaches the age of 18 years old. The application for Islamic credit card financing will be applicable for people that have reached with the amount of 24000 Even though people get 24000 per year, they are likely to choose someone who has the wages above 24000 For instance, the wage of 28000 or 30000 per annum. This is essential because the risk of the user become default and not able to pay back the financing to them will be higher when they have minimum basic income rather than people with wage above 24000 in a year. Finally, users may get the chance to apply the credit card financing when have a good financial literacy and history of payment. Those payments will be recorded in Secrets and Secrets Record and it will show the status of the financial, whether it's healthy or worse. So, the user must be disciplined to maintain good record of financial payment for banks to be confident in acknowledge the effort and get him a chance to get the credit card financing out. In nutshell, Islamic card credit has different type of function and privilege depending on its type and condition. Most of them have very strict rule and condition despite the feature convenience which being prepared by RHP Bank. Each of the card can be applied if the user reaches the age of 21 years old. 
but share credit card can be applied if the user has the income of 24,000 per year and actually premium visa internet credit card will be applicable for those who have income of 80,000 per annum and above. The more amount of income and credit card will be spent, the more benefit and privilege will get in the future. However, the risk to be default will also increase according to our payment record system and our commitment. Those advantages and disadvantages must be taken into consideration for applying because it can be a tool of help or burden, depending on the way of use and discipline in fulfilling all the obligation to pay and duties that exist in the same time. That's all for me. Thank you.